It does a lot of damage, as we can see. Why is there only three of you today? Now, I've been informed that there's a boss that might be even stronger than Ekda. Hey, yo, everyone, welcome back to another episode of Can Terraria Bosses Survive? Today, we are checking out another weapon here the Normal Sword. Normal Sword, nothing to brag about from the Normal Sword mod. Take a shot every time I say Normal Sword. You're like four shots in already. Shots of water, I hope. But yeah, as we can see, this thing does a good bit of damage. It's a Normal Sword. It looks like a Lance from 1.4 if we look at it. Let's get right into it. Okay, y'all already know who we have to beat up on today the King Slime what is up so i believe this thing shoots projectiles oh i didn't really get to show it off against the dummies but yeah it shoots projectiles the projectiles do a lot of damage the melee swing itself does a lot of damage let's go ahead and see it in action here so this is with the projectile in the melee swing getting this is let me stand back a little it's a little hard because uh apparently i'm hitting something behind me with this swing but yeah the projectile is hitting right there and then uh i guess this is just the melee hitting it does a lot of damage, as we can see. But yeah, let's get on to it. Skeletron, shoot some in the eye. Shoot some in the queen bee. Get them all out here. Hit her with the backswing. Okay, that's not the backswing. Come on, walk into me. Got her ass. On to the brain, who is one of my favorite vanilla bosses to test here. Damn, if I got hit with a bunch of debuffs. All right, let's see here. Okay, I hit one of them. <laughs> we could probably insta-kill everything at once on initial spawn. Okay, kind of, not really. I don't think this sword uh, has got that big of a swing. It makes it a little bit harder, you know? It's not no sword of the universe or anything. On to another favorite boss that I like to test here, because these are the bosses that always have something interesting every time. Usually. Usually something interesting every time. Like, that That took a while. That honestly took a while. It definitely has to just be because the sword is so tiny, and to the, the projectiles are so tiny. Like, look at the projectile size. It's making it harder. But yes, sir, you already know since we're out here. Lepus, let's kill him with the projectiles. Got him. Turkor, hit him with the projectiles. Hit him in the head first. And because I include the Dark Mage now in the pre-hard mode section. Yes, sir. Dark Mage. Hit him with, listen him with the sword. And then let's spawn in the, the other pre armor one. Also hit him with that sword. Because I guess this one isn't really a pre hard mode one, is it? The second phase one? It's really the first phase one. So I said in the last episode that I don't fight the wall of flesh enough on the right side of the map. You can see where like all the kills are by where the boxes are. And the middle of the map is pretty filled. The left side, it's got like one or two every now and then. But we're on the right side. Let's fight the wall of flesh on the right side. Let's get some boxes over here. Boom. See you later. I bet if you count how many times I say boom and see you later in this and all, every other catchphrase I use in this series, you know, you get, you get a pretty big number. I say those words a lot during this. It is time for the mech trio. I should do it for one episode. I should get the steam trio out from the Enigma mod just to change it up. I should do like a big change up episode one time. How many episodes are we at? Once we hit like episode 30, maybe I'll do like a big change up and just do some like random bosses for a bunch of other mods. I feel like that'd be a fun thing. All right, Golem and Plantera time. We do them at the same time now to save some time. I said time a lot. What's up with me today? I feel like I'm saying a lot of words today. You know, I need to switch up my vocabulary or something. Use some new words. I'm too lazy to look up some new words though. Maybe I should just make up my own words. All right, let us go ahead and take on the mini boss is here this should be no problem let's get the morning wood and of course every scream out here how y'all doing uh -oh. no, 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 none of that come on now i'm trying to hit 300k subs with this video we can't be having that going on but yeah as i'm recording this video i think i'm at like 298,000 something make sure y'all hit that sub button if i'm not at 300k by the time you guys see this again thank you guys for all the love and support remember once we hit that 300k, I'm going to start streaming with the face cam on Twitch. We're going to do some funny things on there. Maybe I'll dress up as some uh, Terraria NPCs. No female NPCs, though. That's already my rule. But yeah, let us continue here killing the bosses. Oh, do these projectiles go through walls? They do. I thought I caught them before he went under. I'm doing these bosses in really weird order, so I'm hoping I don't miss anything. I shouldn't, but I'm, I am doing them in a weird order, so I really might. Like the sand tank, he tried to slip through my grasp right there while I was talking. Same thing with the UFO. They really tried to slip past me while I was talking. You know, it's a rainy day kind of episode, I guess. I don't know why it's, it's raining so much. I, I thought I have uh, rain turned off. Or at least I, I usually come onto the world and click stop everything. But we had a sandstorm. We had a rain. Like, it didn't matter today. You already know what time it is. Can we get a RIP for the... Hold up. We're missing one. What the hell? <laughs> why is there only three of you today? All right, you know what? I'm going to line you guys up here. Rest in peace, the boys. Why? There really was only three of them. 
One of them was getting tired of getting killed all the time. It's understandable, honestly. All right, let's do it. Speed run. You already know what time it is. Come on, speed run. This, this has to hit it, right? Oh, I kind of missed. Speed run, boom. We're here. Uh, where is it? Where is it? There it is. Boom. I, I think that we're not going to break the PB. We're not going to break the record like this. Oh, we broke that one. I don't know how, but we hit it. So maybe, maybe we just saved it right there. We might have just saved it. That might have been a personal best right there. Did you see that? Some projectiles that I shot earlier just flew past me. You know, I guess while we wait, we could go ahead and take on the Dungeon Guardian. You know, we find some time here. Oh, Dungeon Guardian not dying. He's not dying. Let me put you over there. Not dying. It's Calamity's fault. Look, there's more projectiles I shot earlier. Hey, our boy is here. Damn it, I forgot to hit the top eye. My hands are off the keyboard. It's all good. I get to sit here and wait around. Maybe play with some of the eyeballs. Here, give me that eyeball. Go over there. Oh, it's open. There we go. Can I move him while he's dying? Hey, hey, my boy giving us a show. Hey, what move is that? This dude been playing Just Dance or something. All right, let's go ahead and hop straight into the Thorium bosses, of course. Starting with our favorite, Abyssion. No armor, Abyssion. Dies instantly. Armored Abyssion. Lives with one health, but dies because his sword swings a lot. Oh, there you go. I was able to click just once. I was able to click just just once. It's really hard to click just once like that. All right, on to the primordials here. Uh, can I get like an angle like this? No, I can't because they teleport after they spawn in. Okay, it's all good. Oh, killed the dream eater on accident there. Let's just make the dream eater be really loud real quick. I love it. Music to my ears. All right, let us fight the deviant and uh, wait, no, not the deviant. We're not doing the deviant anymore. Let me fight the mutant. Let's just hop straight into the mutant here. The mutant having some resistance, not getting instantly killed. Maybe the weapon just doesn't do enough damage. Uh, how much health does the mutant have? I can't even see. The mutant has a lot of health, so it might just not be doing enough damage, honestly, which is understandable. But he's also not damage capping. We are still putting up big numbers, so that's honestly not surprising there. All right, we got our calamity items here. Let's get to it, our calamity bosses. Dog, where you at, dog? and he does not get insta killed let me try his tail let me try his tail with just a projectile no sir all right dog congratulations you live this time but let's see the second phase i usually doubt that the second phase. where's he going why's he going so fast i doubt that his second phase is gonna be killable it usually isn't if the first phase isn't killable the second one usually is where you at nothing all right come here let me insta kill you with another weapon though. On to the dragon. Fly down a little bit. There you go. Now it lets me summon it in. What's up, Jack? What did you get hit by? Why are you missing health already? Oh, that was some good damage right there. One more. One more hit. Maybe a couple more. Let me get close. And you're dead. Pretty much. You're dead. Am I missing? It's just doing one damage now. I like how there's projectiles of yarn shoots that like take damage. It's, it's so weird. Okay, I don't know why I can't do damage anymore like a cap turned on and i just oh there you go all right what, what just happened was it this motherfucker you're helping me out <laughs> hans the mutant i think i hit the the actual like killing blow but i think hans was helping out a little too much there bro hans hey we need to have a talk man this is uh, can terraria bosses survive the normal sword not can terraria bosses survive hans the mutant get the hell out of here all right, let's go ahead and take on Cal. Hopefully, uh, Hans doesn't bother us from over here. Oh, you guys already know what time it is. Get ready for some Game Raiders 101 juke sessions. Look at this. Easy. In the UFO, too? Look at this. Oh, fuck. All right. Do I even attack the Sepulcher? Like, the Sepulcher never takes damage. Well, we've seen it die every now and then, but you know what I mean. Well, majority of the time, it's not taking any damage. Supreme Cal, though. Oh, only taking 60s? Only 60s? I don't know, bro. Oh, yeah, dash him. Dash him. Yeah, this is this is an L here. Yarn it was working on, but here it doesn't seem to be working. You know, I guess since we're here fighting her, let's just spawn in the Eidolon Worm. Save some time here, because I'm going to leave the world. I don't, I don't feel like killing her all the way with a different weapon. Eidolon Worm does not die. I honestly expect it. You know, I've been informed that there's a boss that might be even stronger than Ek Death which honestly is some crazy stuff to hear that that is crazy to hear and uh we might check it out in the future okay we might check it out in the future maybe we'll save it for episode 30 because i think we're approaching on episode 30 very very soon i think we're almost at 20 maybe we're past 20 i don't know but yeah it is time for the finale against egg death i think unless i missed something no nah, i don't know maybe i did miss something all right egg death let's do it i don't expect we're gonna kill egg death but you never know you never know take off all everything yeah it's not looking good 
It's not looking good. Maybe the, the sword hit itself does a lot of damage. We're about to see in a second. Oh, absolutely not. Hey, let's do the outro over here. This area looks nice. All right, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Again, leave weapon recommendations for the future. I've been noticing a lot of uh, strong weapons are appearing on the on the mod browser all of a sudden. So we honestly might just have content off of that. But yeah, leave suggestions. Again, make sure to hit the subscribe button. We're about to hit 300k if we are already. Thank you guys very much. Make sure to check out my Twitch because obviously we're going to be streaming with the face cam more often. I love you guys. See you guys next time.